Ah, uh, boom, chat. Number one, two, three, four, five, or six. I want a prediction in the chat right now. Just based off. I know this one don't judge a book by its cover, but doing that today, I don't give a shit. Who do you lot think it is? Number one, two, three, four. I can't lie, it can't be number one. Number one looks like he still claims benefits. Number one looks unemployed. He looks, I don't know. He looks like he'd be smoking cigarettes since he was at least in year seven. My man is not a single as well. I can't lie to you. He's an, he's, a, he's, a, he's an accountant and finance manager. Number three, he looks more of like a busker. You know that man that sing like on the streets for money and that? He looks like more one of them, man. But I don't think he's like an actual singer singer. You know them ones like. But number four, she don't sing. She's a dentist. Obviously, she's a dentist. That's why she's smiling like that. She's a dentist. Number six, I reckon. No, I'm not even trying to be racist, but I reckon it's her. She's built like a singer. She's built like one of them little light skinned R&B singers that like the ones that never really make it. You know the ones that like they never really make it, but they reach like a good level. Like they perform at local like local clubs and that. And then number six, if number six is a singer, then I'm a Ross Clark. I don't even know, G. If number six is a singer, then I'm a flipping Somali pirate. But yeah, if I was to go up my guess, I'll go for even number three. Number three, number three, or number five. That's my, that's my, that's my initial guess. That's my judging book by its cover. Obviously, the guy wearing the suit is here to throw us off. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> now nah, her, I think she's the real singer. You based off what? Just eyeing it. Introduce yourself from number one. I'm Owen. Uh, my alias is Half Tracks. It's got merch. I'm 25 and I'm from Luton. There's no way he's the singer. <laughs> <laughs> know. Number three. Her name's Luca Zaccotti, 24, Afrobeats artist from Manchester. Mm, it's him. Luca Zaccotti. Zakati, it's him, chat. It's him, and he's from Manchester. He's from Manchester. I, I, I like, I thought I would know him, but now I don't. Afrobeats. Oh, no, <laughs> man, when he was appalled. What type of like? What, what vibe? I get uh, compared to be young a lot. What about Burner Boy? Does anyone compare you to him? Yeah. That's not possible. <laughs> that's not possible. <laughs> that's a matter of possible. I'm telling you, this man, number six, the suavest of the ball. Talk to me, please, brother. Hi, I'm D. Alex. I'm 47. I'm a singer, and I do pretty good. He don't even believe it. I swear to God. He don't believe it. I said I do pretty good. He sings. What type? What type? All types, brother. <laughs> Number six, don't yeah, think I... Yeah, like every basketball video, there's one guy that's actually just there. It's actually just there for the vibes, and that's him. Number three, since we're on you, what's the best lyric you've ever wrote? Ooh, Ooh that's a good question. question. Best lyric I've ever wrote? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's actually a hard lyric, though. That's a, no, that's how... I mean, that's a hard... Um, that's actually a hard question, okay? Any any real artist will take time to answer that question. Call that. Every artist thinks all their bars are hard, even though most of you lot are flipping tired. But every artist thinks their bars are hard, though. I don't think I don't think any artist could answer that question like, just like that. Omen a true. Who's got the vocals on them? I feel like there'll be one or two that will be dead and the rest are gonna be lit. Start with you, number one. Show us what you got. Oh, she move like a million. Yeah, man, she pending in. Her Bro. That's not an old singer, G. What kind of white reg what kind of white wash reggaeton is that, G? That's not even vibes cartel, that's vibes bike tail. That's not even cartel, that's bike tail. Blends in it, I blends it up. I've grabbed the grub, I hit the pub, I slip the scrub into the shrub, my skin. I grab the grub and hit the pub. Oh my day, this is Brexit music right here, chat. This is that I voted leave rap. Man, chat to me, man. There's a lot of artists he's better than right, man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Number two. Classic, right? I can do French, Italian, English. All of them in one. All of them in one. Do English. English, yeah, sure, sure, sure. If you will be my love. Nah, he's actually decent, so he's decent. But I don't mean he's actually, actually a singer, though. And this is how you know that like us men are so black, bro, including these men on the panel, yeah? Because, bro. Bear man, we actually have no clue about that genre of music. Like, we don't, we actually don't know if that's good or not. Because that might sound good to us, but who are we to know what's good and what's not? Because none of us listen to classic music. And I'm trying to say, like, if you go into like an opera house here yeah, and you start rapping, no matter how shit you are, you're going to sound good because they don't know nothing about rap. See, as he's singing, you see everyone else look at each other in the back. Because <laughs> <laughs> they know they're in trouble. I see not regular, spin my medulla. So I tell her, baby, come back up. I tell her, baby, come back up, back up, back up. And if you're Nah, you know what it is? It's the Nigerian man queen accent is killing me. A man said, I tell her, baby, come back up. Back up, back up, back up. Brother, are you from flipping Lagos or are you from Longsight, G? Make a rock slap mind up. But he's decent though, he's actually decent. But I reckon he'd be harder if he just sang normally instead of trying to get Afrobeat thing. I can't like. Can't escape the memories. 
Shivers run down my spine. Ah, she got a decent verse, but it's the, the the rhythm's off, like the rhythm's off, man. The like she's not flowing, she's not flowing smoothly. I can't lie to you. Like, obviously, you man don't know music, innit? Like me, like man grew up and Simon Khan and them and there. Like the man's from that same school school of thought as them and there, G. So I know, I know, what I'm talking about that. Like. Every night, every night. How did you know that was coming? I know music, man. I mean, still got it, you know, she's still got there. That one's mental. Yeah. Impressive. That yeah. one's yeah. mental. This was Banner's pick, to be honest, so. Not a first time touching mic. Yeah, she knows she's dead. Now you calling on my phone, but you missing what you playing games are finally moving on. Uh, it's giving, it's giving singing in the shower. It's giving like I just sing in the shower for fun. You know what I mean? We're on the fifth one and I have no idea who this singer is. They they can all sing. Okay, so Frozone. I've got decent voices, but hear, hear my voice, hear my voice chat. <coughs> I wanna be a billionaire. <coughs> Sorry, my bad, my bad, my bad. Do your homework. I wanna be a billionaire, so fucking bad. I don't even know the, I don't even know the words to that. I don't even know the words to that song. So let me show a different. Let me show a different song. Let me show a different song. <coughs> and the bedroom feel just a little bit bigger now. Come my heart breaks a little when I hear your name. It all just sounds like oh. Oh, too young, too dumb to realize that I should have bought you flowers. And hey, right, next time, next time, I'm ill, I'm ill today, I'm ill, I'm ill. No! Thank you. Yeah, my man just came to go viral. He just came for viral moments. I can't lie, I respect you, Dari. I rate, I rate, I'll do the same thing. Mary had a little lamb, yeah. little Good lamb. Good day. Yeah, Mary's got a copyright. <laughs> He's unique, I told you. Would you get him on one of your tracks? Hell no. <laughs> Everybody wants to be different in some way, you know? That's his way. Alright, Broski still got this. You can still see the spray in his hairline still. I can't lie. You know he got you know he got a flipping haircut on set just before they said action. Uh AJ. Oh yeah, um I'm triangle today. Hello everyone. It's either one or three, I'm gonna go three. And six, right? Because you've got yeah, two. Yeah, three and six, three and six. I'm gonna go six, obviously. And four. I'm sorry. I feel like you write songs for fun, but I don't know if you do it professionally. I don't know. I just I thought... I'd vote for five and six. Like obviously like BLM and that, but I'll get them to you get them to you out of there. I can't lie to you, man. Like, I get it. there has to be diversity and all of that, but G, I'd vote for five and six, me personally, innit? I'm gonna vote for one of my favourite songs of all time. Six and four, sixty-four Zulane. Sixty-four, 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 64 Zulane. Zulane. That's literally the only reason I voted for both of them. But what a song. Real ones remember. I would have voted for sixty-four Zulane. Vote for six and one, but four you're out. Thank you very much. Number four and six. Peace love. Thank you guys. All right, round three, it's question time. AJ, you got a question? My question is, what software does everyone record on? So usually I use Fruity Loops. When I go to the studio, it's either Ableton or Cubase. He knows a lot of stuff. In the classical singing world, we'll go to specific professional recording studios, dot about Europe and record albums that way. Brother, what do you record on? He's capping, man. Everyone uses software. I work closely with my producer, but I believe Logic. Last but not least. I use Logic as well, but I have trust in all my producers. She, she's capping, she's capping. She actually is a copied man, man. She copied man, well, exactly what my man said. Luckily, not that bad. Have you travelled to like Africa? Nah, so we're hoping this year, if not January, February, Nigeria, yeah. Yeah, Afrobeat. Go in December, my boy. Singer, I've never been to Nigeria. <laughs> What's everyone's biggest song? Like most streams? Mine's a song called Morning Coffee. And how many streams? I sat on 700,000 at the moment. Go on, give me a rendition of Morning Coffee quick. I want a coffee, wake up, put in the toffee. Siggy's got me coffee. I want a coffee, wake up, put it in the toffee. This guy's a flipping fraud, chat. He's a fraud. Switch it up a lot, G. Ah, right, cool. Now, I was just, I was just seeing if it was a real song. Yes. He's meaty. I can't lie. He is so tired. Oh my days. If he's the real singer, I'm disappointed in singing. Probably the most famous one that everyone knows because Pavarotti sung it at the World Cup, and that was Nessun Dorma. How oh, many streams? I know, I, even I know that one. This is the most. <sighs> Pavarotti's a couple million. Couple million. And now I'm starting to think he might just be a crazed fan. No, no, no. He's too gifted, bro. No, he's incredible. He's not. Uh... I don't want to be a hater, but he ain't, he ain't as gifted as they're making now, I can't lie. One I released like three, four months ago. What's it called? What's it's called, called Madder. It's cool. 850,000. And what's the song? Night and Day. Can we hear 12 seconds of Night and Day? Oh, baby, lately, no, you got me going 
crazy. Child, my she be her, you know. My she be her still. My she be her, child. Raw. I said it's giving singing and shout. I might have to take that back. I can't lie. I might have to over oh, oh, my bad because it might actually be her chat. A couple of weeks ago, Manchester Carnival main stage came on just before Style OG. It was crazy. Well, let me look in. Let me see them eyes <laughs> and say what you said again. Performed a couple months ago, Manchester Carnival. Oh! He said, so come on. Alright, number three is. Now, Manchester Carnival was. was Manchester Carnival. It depends when they filmed this, though. Manchester Carnival was August, innit? Start of August. So couple months ago makes no sense because even if they filmed it today august not a couple months ago manchester carnival does not count as a performance gee i'm not gonna lie to you no hey i ain't even weeping on manchester carnival because ever bigger everyone doing that thing but gee man's been there manchester carnival basically just like a primary school assembly i said it do hit different it's a primary school assembly i can't lie to you chat when exactly did you perform i performed two of my singles no no when he said, when do your homework uh, he said when what day? What day? Yeah. <laughs> Chat, he's over whooping. Yeah. One month, you don't even know what month? Oh, uh, August. Oh, wait, wait, wait. wait. <laughs> <laughs> I can't lie though, Burner Boy's been itching to get him out. Ever since the Burner, uh, he said he makes Afro beats, yeah. Burner Boy was itching to get him out still. So he's thinking, brother, I can, there can't be more than one Afro beat singing in this room right now. How many songs have you put out? Three. When did you put out your first song? Last year, probably like October. When did you drop the second song? The second one after that was probably about three months. And then the third one was when? Third one, four. So when did you start doing shows then? Recently, I've only been doing shows for like the last two years. Like after I finished high school is when I properly started to pursue music. Wait, but Wait, show, shows for two years, but your first song was August. He's a detective. She whooped. They caught the whoop. Nico caught the whoop. How can you be performing for two years? You only be making music for one year. Mind games. Mind games. So you have a booking agent and stuff? So I'm signed. What label? 23 Formation. They're not a major, but yeah, I got signed in January. Number one, you signed? Fully independent. Uh, I do my own events. Of producing this brother. Does this bread look like he signed? Imagine chat. Imagine being an AR for a label, yeah. Sitting down for a meeting. One of your your A and R's tell you, yo, like I got a new up and coming talent, a singer. I want I want to introduce him to the team, and this bread walks in. Bro, I'm quitting. I'm I'm getting a normal answer. I'm quitting, bro. Imagine this bread walking into the office. You think this guy's getting any money from any label on earth? What's the largest crowd you've got? June we did thousand thousand people in Bedford. Does Bedford even have? Nah, that's a whoop. That's a whoop, chap. Do your homework. Uh, that's a whoop. That's a whoop. That's a whoop. A thousand people in Bedford. Bedford, that's a whoop. That's a blatant whoop. I can't lie. It's over whooping right now. It's over whooping. Headliner was a hip hop group called The Four Owls and supported by another guy called Jam Baxter. He's answering quick as well. You know what it is, though? You could be a f actor. Or an event maker, event organizer who has yeah. skin in the game. Number one seems to be talking so much about events that it's making me think that maybe he just works in events. Like, I feel like a singer wouldn't know as much as he knows. I can't look at the Sharky looking at um, Burner Boy. I can't lie. If my girl don't look at me the way Sharky looking at Burner Boy, then it's not real. It's not real. If your girl don't look at you the way Sharky looking at Burner Boy, then she's cheating. It's <laughs> Afro Beats, yeah. <laughs> it's my so I'm gonna lie, I still feel like it might be him, though. I still feel like it might be him, child. I can't lie to you. you know. I've been saying it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, good. Yeah. So you want number three out? Because he hasn't felt comfortable from the second you came in, sir. So. Yeah, man. Afro Beat guy needs to go now. Less Burner Boy's little cotton socks. He's following where me and Kenny go. Clearly a big fan of the Nigerian half of Beta Squad, so I like it. What do we do? Banner Boy gets two votes, therefore he is voted for number three, and therefore you are out, brother. All right, thank you for making me laugh. He was vibes. Number one. Loyal Kana. That would just be so cold for me. Some of the old, like, grandma is Kano. I'd love to do, like, a vocal thing for him. That'd be sick. Have a right. My equivalent of collabs performing with was uh, Simon Kinley side is a famous bard. Yeah, no, he's very yeah, good. he's so good. You might know this guy's name's Bryn Turfel, he's Welsh. Oh, ho, 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 he's cold. cold. Oh, he's cold. cold. And then number five? I'd probably say Usher. Oh! Yeah, yeah. Starting from you, number one, could you make a song about everyone on this table? I want to see how quickly you can write and formulate a tune. I mean, I prepared one earlier. Bro, oh, he was on point, he's on point. Go on then. Before I say that's it. That's how you know it's not really him though. This, I like all you guys, I watch you. Oh, so this, you're casting us. It's all love, innit? Go on. Nico, you're just a neek though. You got slap. I said, it do hit different. Wow. And Burner Boy, thanks for being on time, mate. Had us waiting round, mate. So much time and then he ran out of rhymes, mate. <laughs> oh! Tired, tired. Tired, meaty. I said, it do hit different. That was meaty. I come to you, you're a bit of a sellout. He's fresh out of luck with the titties on his chest out. 
Yeah, Ooh. mental. So. If you think you're staying here, nah. <laughs> <laughs> Number one thinks he's funny. I didn't like it from the start. He's coming with his little. Man, Cole Chung and Silla, that was deep. That was, like, that was kind of a bit too far, I can't lie. He's not a professional singer, he's a professional rapper. And he's swindling us this whole time because he could do a little bit of vocals. I don't know how we didn't see this earlier. I'm not much of a freestyler, but play a beat and the melodies. Yeah, Philly in the do rag. He's sitting, looking real nice. A sharky with the, with the apple on his head. I don't know why. Bernard with a nice lineup always. Yeah, Chunks, A in the suave, in the suave. Yeah, now Nico just. Bro, I'm just waiting for one rhyme, chat. I'm just waiting for one rhyme, just one rhyme, that's it. Like, Fairness got melodies in that. I'm just waiting for one rhyme. Oh, I can't lie. Oh, I can't lie. She forgot her name. No. Do your homework. Uh, do your homework. Uh, my side. It do hit different. She forgot his name. That's a diss. That's a diss. She's got to go. Do your homework. She's going. She's going. His She's going. She's going. She's going. She's going. She didn't even know my name. You know what? I said this. Do your homework. Uh, At this point, there is no chance. There's no way in hell I'm gonna keep her. <laughs> I'm here, might as well. But his name is Kenny. Kenny. Nah, oh, it's too loud on here. <laughs> no, it's too late for all that. She tried to. <laughs> all right, so you now. That's what's it, your it. plans, like? I'd like to build a team around me. I think like it would alleviate a lot of stress. But for now, I'm all about getting my bread up. What's your plan? Every opera singer's goal is to perform in the biggest places alongside the best singers. But for me, it's just also bringing. This guy's always just chatting too much, bro. Just chatting too much, bro. Oh. These AI generated answers, brother. You guys are always just chatting bears. Time for the voting. Philly? I'm gonna go it. I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna say number two. <gasps> Why? <laughs> no! Do you know what it is? Your voice is so amazing. That like anything you said, I, I just didn't care at first. But the more I listen to you, it just sounds too like scripty. Yeah, so yeah, yeah, number yeah, two. Of course. I still think it's number five. She serenaded you, Sharky. Yeah, but clearly not enough, so I'm phoning around. Number five was told to freestyle. And she looked at me and she said. He's got a lap on his hat, and I don't know why. Surely if you've got music, ability, you can come up with something better than that. Even though I dislike number one's uh, freestyle, but I'm gonna vote for number five. I'm sorry, sorry. Hey, number five. <laughs> I'm gonna vote for you. Bye bye. No, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. There's still someone left. Obviously, he's gonna vote me. Yeah, you don't know my name. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. <laughs> I did not say rap. I'm singing, I'm singing. I saw the look on her face. Last you wanna come. Nah, bro, it's even like Ted Sheeran, G. It's even like Ted Sheeran. Like. What angle? Take it away, number two. For a quamar, O souffle du printemps. Number two genuinely has talent here, okay? It's time to be serious. He might even be better than Burner Boy. You know, last, last, the song. Nah, no, 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 Can you both try and perform? Nah, Broski almost banged Nick on the face. He got a bit. Like what makes the best singers is versatility. So, it's time to switch it up. This Nick. That's a good challenge, though. Kobe is ruining everything, bro. How you gonna, how you wanna flip? You won't make this guy sing this guy and this guy. When the Number two's was a good performance. You guys wouldn't know that because uh, it's copyrighted. So, uh, yeah, you heard one word. But, yeah, I'm telling you right now, decent performance. Not really hip-hop, but good. Now, number one. Can we, can we hear some opera, please? Hey, Chai, hold it down, though. Mm. You Sound like, you just have to sound like you're yawning. Big man thing. Take the chance. I'm gonna say number one. I think you are the professional. AJ. I'll be honest, I don't know who to pick. I feel like it's neither of you. But I feel like it was number four. So I'm just gonna pick number one. So there's two votes on number one. I'm gonna vote for number one. I think number one is the professional singer. After you sung to me the way which you sung to me, there's never a, a way in a million years I'm not thinking that you're the <laughs> professional. <laughs> so I believe that it's you. Thanks, mate. Yeah, number two. I think it's you as well. Oh, so we're tied up. Again? Oh my gosh. You know who the decision comes down to, innit? What, well, man? 
Hey. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> that's a meme. He said, what meme? That was cold. But, but there's not much on the line, just £1,000, which we will lose if you get it wrong for us. He's wearing a, a million diamonds. <laughs> <laughs> you think? <laughs> yeah, I'll stick to Pavarotti. Right. So Bernard is sticking with number two, and as he is the professional singer, his vote counts as two. So we voted for number two. Will the real professional singer please step forward? Oh, this is the worst part. But Chashi was needy. Ah! That's what happens when you're too premature. I didn't vote for number one, not once. Yeah, why did they take her out? I don't get it. I think it was me and Kenny that actually didn't vote for her, so me and Kenny won. The rest are losers. Can you tell us your story, please? I grew up doing musical theatre, and then I went to the Brit School. Go back to the Brit School, G, because the fact they didn't win that video was embarrassing. From an art school in South London, I work a lot with dance producers and DJs, and I've also got my own music, which is more pop and R&B, and I also am a singer songwriter, so, song yeah. so I do songwriting as well. Have you wrote for anyone before, like we know? I've worked with Nathan Dorr. He said, that white you, that white you is actually a singer though. Like my brother knows, he actually doesn't make Afrobeats music, but he's just not professional, that's the thing. Oh, God odds. Oh, yes. 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 yes, yes, Number one. Uh, I'm a digital marketing manager. You do events? I do events, Wait, yeah, yeah. Wait, he, has a, he has a job, wow. He's an event organizer. That was a complete- And Nico was right though. He shot in the dark. And we hit number three. I can't wait to hear what you've got to say. Everything I told you is pretty much true. Afrobeats artist. On the come up. Yeah, man, hopefully. Five. I'm a receptionist at a dental surgery, but I am still an upcoming artist in Melbourne. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, she's an artist. Oh, fair's my bad, then, my bad. And number six, let's hear your story, please. <laughs> Why are we laughing already? I sell ice cream. <laughs> story, please. Why are we laughing already? I sell ice cream. Is that ice cream, man? Oh my day. <laughs> Careful, careful. <laughs> Number two, you have one, oh, yeah, the thousand pounds. Well done, brother, mate. Thanks. This guy, fam. All right, well, there you have it. We lost. Ben, any last words? Play the trailer. <laughs> <laughs>